The Orioles took the lead early in the game. Al Bumbry was pretty confident. They're better at broadcasting than they are at playing basketball. But the WBOC All-Stars fought hard to stay in there. Coach Marty Thorson was never ready to give up. What's the story here? Well, the strategy here is to let them, you know, roll them into a false sense of security, give them that big 13-point lead. Yeah. But the O's kept their lead. Cal Ripken Jr. says it wasn't easy, but it was fun. Heck, I don't know. It, the game's not over yet. Maybe not quite as fun for all the WBOC All-Stars. Going back in, how do you feel? Sick. Why? I don't like making a fool out of myself in front of all these people. But all agreed it was for a good cause. An announced estimate of $12,000 was raised for the LaCates family of Portland to help their two children, Jimmy and Johnny, receive bone marrow transplants for a rare disease they have each had since birth. Mr. and Mrs. LaCates were at the game with Jimmy. All the people here and, and the efforts of the Lions Club and Sue Ellen Wilkins has just been beyond any of our wildest dreams. The game was organized by Sue Ellen Wilkins with the help of the Willards Lions Club. Sue Ellen was proud of the outcome. It's just been great. I, I just can't express how I feel to see this crowd here tonight and, and the help of everybody in every way that I wouldn't dare mention any names afraid I'd forget someone. It's just been great. When it was over, the final score didn't even seem to matter when you thought about what had been done. Mark Hubbard, WBOC News, Salisbury.